Uh, hello there, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to our stream of Ark Survival Evolved. Uh, I forgot I was uh, here already. Now, anyway, I have been meaning uh, to stream this for the longest time, but I unfortunately haven't been able to because at the time I wanted to stream this, my Twitch wasn't working for some bizarre reason. Etc. Uh, and so on and so forth. Anyways, um. <coughs> yeah, this is Ark, and this here is my Quetzalcoatlus, uh, uh, that I have named Skylar Khan. Now, frankly, uh, if I were to pick a dinosaur game that Stream. Aside from Ark, which is strictly just here because it's a fun game to get into every now and then, and etc. But beyond that, this game really doesn't have much else to offer unless uh, they were to make us some changes to it. Quite frankly, I know for a fact that in, in terms of changes, I definitely upgrade the fucking textures on these models. Not to mention it'd be a little bit more elaborate with the uh, animations and such. But if I had to pick a survival game that involved dinosaurs, I am going to recommend to you uh, The Isle, which is on Steam. And it's basically uh, just a fucking uh, a survival game at where currently it's in early access, it's in the alpha stages, really good game uh, so far though. I have it, it is a lot of fun. Um, the Isle basically allows you to be able to play as dinosaurs, either as herbivore or carnivore. Eventually you'll be able to, uh, um, Ow, don't know how those titanic balls are. Um, but as I was saying, the, um, the game will eventually allow you to, uh, um, how do I put this? Be able to play as humans eventually. Goddamn titanic balls, you are fucking everywhere. Ow! Is everything hating me already? Yeah, and if you guys are at all curious as to what the hell I'm doing here, I'm currently attempting to uh, find myself a fucking Dimetrodon. Because it's one of my favorite Permian period creatures. Dimetrodon, in case if you watch this, don't know what Dimetrodon is. Uh, it's a mammal like reptile that predated uh, the dinosaurs. I really need to make uh, this uh, map. Uh, bigger than it currently is, because I'm getting fucking weird as hell that I'm almost never going to see any fucking this damn server unless I sit there and slaughter a bunch of fucking animals in this. Which may end up eventually becoming the case. Uh, frankly, to let you guys know, this game, in my opinion, definitely needs to be Its map definitely needs to be bigger. Simply due to the fact that, uh, officially they have 93 dossiers for creatures out there that they are going to be implementing into this game. And the fact that they have 93 and they're trying to fit them all on a map that is smaller than 16 by 16 kilometers. 
Rose is ridiculous, especially considering the outrageous sizes uh, that these uh, creatures are in. Quetzalcoatlus, for example, way bigger than it actually is. Quetzalcoatlus only has uh, a fucking 40 to 50 foot wingspan, and it is 16 feet tall. This monstrosity is bigger. Not to mention its posture would be a bit more of a giraffe in terms of uh, like how it stand does. Anyway, you guys are probably interested on uh, seeing the rest of my creatures, so let's fly home. I have not been on this game in a couple of weeks, especially as it's actually been a week since I played this. Uh, last time I did this, it was all looking for the Dimetrodon, the Gallimimus, and etc. Has I haven't been successful at all, and I got to a point where I'm just like, oh, fuck it. I'm just gonna wait till this game. Finished, and then maybe I'll then maybe my interest will be re peaked. Anyway, here are all my creatures on this part of the island. Let's hop down and show you all. Uh, that's Animal, Parasaurolophus, Gimlet, uh, Beasel Buffo. Hippogriff and Griffin, both Argentavises, Scorpion, and a female one that I have that I have yet to name. Silas, my Dilophosaur, Terence, my very first uh, fucking Pteranodon. Whom I have lost uh, twice, and he has been bad luck for me a couple of times. Anyway, here is a. Uh, Kata. I can't tell if that's a fucking I or an L. Anyway, here's Rayless. Uh, this is Gabriel, my uh, Bronto, or as scientists have actually named him, a Patasaurus. Which, uh, that is if you want to be uh, technical in terms of paleontology, but everyone still calls it a patasaur, a bronto. Which I don't understand why. I, I like, quickly adjusted uh, to calling it an apatosaur instead of a bronto most of my life. Anyway, this is Helen, my first triceratops. Cutter, uh, my second. And Nikki, my third. I have a Parasitherium that I've yet to learn how to make a saddle for. Kylos, my Ankylosaurus. Which I think in reality an Ankylosaurus is actually a bit bigger than that. Bit being the keyword. Um, here we got Warpig and uh, fucking Fiomi. And here we... Good fucking... Okay, I... I need this monstrosity. I did not want to sit there and... What the fuck? I need to really be logged on more often. Anyway, um, this here is Verlaine. Narashim. Uh, I don't know. Draco Raptor X and Turbo. Uh, oh, there was a fifth. Oh, no matter. Uh, Draconis, uh, my male T Rex. He's the rocks, man. Then Rexy here. Um, I did actually have my very first 
Rex was a female named exactly like uh, uh, this Rexy here, but in a different color and a bit higher level. That is another unfertilized egg, and I'm not gonna pick it, bother picking that one up this time. Um, over here is my uh, Gigantopithecus uh, Kelsa. And then over here are two spinos that belong to a friend of mine. The one that you currently see uh, directly ahead is uh, Athena. The one on the right uh, who's got the big orange sail is Zeke. And then, uh, Jesse here uh, belongs to that same friend. And this is my Carnotaurus, uh, Ceres. Then I have two Sarkos over here, uh, Sarana and Daedalus. And yep, um, the two carbon nemesis over here. Coincidence! I just uh, tamed them for the fucking dossier. Uh, here we have. Uh, our Megalodon. Where the hell is... Okay. Um, this here is my first uh, Megalodon. Uh, named Jaws. I purposely named him that. Because I'm a big fan of the Jaws movies. And these fucking Megalodons when they're coming at you uh, from deep water is fucking... Then, as you see, uh, we have uh, two uh, ichthyosaurs. So, uh, yeah. Good lord, I may end up descending the stream here shortly because my throat is killing me. I've talked too much today. I'm gonna drop that since it weighs me down so much. Uh, I think uh, this is everyone. Wait, no, it isn't. I uh, get to show you guys some others. Oh, and to answer you guys' questions as to why is it I have a scorp uh, a pulmonal scorpius named Scorpion, is because uh, I, for one, it's easier to like say his name. Second, I am a huge fan of Mortal Kombat, and Scorpion is one of my favorite characters I like to play as, like, original default characters, uh, not ones that are DLC and such, but yeah. Uh, right, we have Debra here, our one and only Dimorphodon. And then here is my pack of dire wolves and my three copies. Got Mike, who is the green copy, the pale one with white feathers, in case you can't see. I have yet to name the other two. Uh, anyway, these are my dire wolves Max, Sarah, Akira, and Cetera. That's pretty much just about everything. Um, I kind of thought I'd just uh, do like an introductory video. I may or may not turn this into a series and whatnot. But if so, um, you guys uh, just uh, let me know if you want me to do it in like a public server or if you just want me to sit here and do not with single player uh, bored out of my mind and doing shit with my friends on a uh, non-dedicated server hosted uh, by your one and only Ebony Dragon. Yeah, I think we can end the stream here. Good lord, my throat. Anyway, um, ladies and gentlemen, this... Sorry about that. Um, this will be a wrap. 
And I hope you enjoyed the video. And I will see you in the next one. Peace.